Mr. Belgorod, other areas of Russia are attacked. Russian volunteers fighting on the side of Ukraine are fighting in the border settlements of the Belgorod region of the Russian Federation, Shebekino, Novaya, Tavolzanka, and others. According to the Secretary of the National Security and Defense Council, Oleksiy Danilov, these raids indicate that the process of fragmentation of Russia, which intensified after the invasion of the occupiers in Ukraine, continues. This is not the first time that Russians with weapons in their hands go to defend their country. And we are already getting used to this, getting used to the situation that was associated with the Russians. I have repeatedly stressed that they have the right. Why not? Why should only we suffer? I don't know what they liberated us from, but I understand exactly what those Russians who are fighting today on the territory of the Russian Federation will be freed from. And I'm more than sure that this is just the beginning. He stressed in an interview with Radio Liberty. According to Danilov, similar incidents will occur in other settlements of Russia. The aggressor country is already forced to use a regular army to counter these raids, but hides this. It will be further. I think that it will not only be Belgorod. You can see what is happening there. Either they start launching drones around Moscow on their own, or they do something else. A strange country, what can I say? From time to time, the army is involved there. It's another matter that they never show it all. You remember at one time when Putin came to power, they demolished entire buildings in Moscow on his instructions. Therefore, there is nothing to be surprised about, says the secretary of the National Security and Defense Council.